If left alone by humans, climax communities will remain steady until there is a change in climate or a natural disaster occurs. Natural disasters that destroy climax communities include forest fires and volcanic eruptions. Even long, severe droughts can kill off these communities. The these disasters cause a sharp decline in the biomass of the ecosystem. But the ecosystem can recover by going back through the stages of ecological succession. Deforestation is one of the main ways that humans change forest ecosystems and destroy climax communities. If a natural disaster does occur, the ecosystem will go back through the stages of succession until it returns to a stable climax community. This means that the community at the end of secondary succession will look very similar to the community that was there prior to the disaster, as long as the climate stays the same. The process of an ecosystem returning to its stable form after a disaster is known as secondary succession. This happens faster than primary succession because soil is already formed and nutrients are more available at the beginning of the process. Instead of taking over a thousand years like primary succession, secondary succession can happen in a matter of decades.